Hello and welcome. This is Sophia from sophiaoja.com. Today I want to show you how you can create a different colored section on your website. As you can see here, this section here, what clients say, has a different background color than the rest of my home page. And that color comes back here where I have my sign up form and it also has a different background color. So I want to show you how you can create that using some custom CSS code. All right, let me jump into the back end of my website. Just to be clear, this is specifically for a page in your index. An index is a collection of pages, as you may know. So I will look for my home page, which is an index that contains all of these sections. Now, what you need to collect is the exact URL of that particular section. So it's important to get the exact URL because this name here may not be the same as your URL. So click on the wheel right here and you can notice my navigation title says testimonials, but my URL slug says what dash clients dash say. So this is the URL slug that you are going to look for. All right. So let me show you how I change this section here. So this section is called Squarespace plus email marketing. That's my second bit of my index collection of pages. I'm going to go over to the wheel and my URL slug says Squarespace dash email dash marketing. All right. So I'm going to change this section here to a different color, not this beige, but a light purple. Let's see how to do that. I'm going to go back to my home panel and look for the design panel. And here under custom CSS, I already have a bit of code going on here, but go all the way to the bottom of that custom CSS and type in pound and the URL slug that you have. So I hope I rem remember it correctly. Squarespace dash email dash marketing. Then open bracket, background, colon, pound, and that's the hex code. That's the color code. And I've already picked out a purple just for demonstration purposes. I don't want it to be the same beige that I have here, but just something different. And that hex code is this one. Ooh, look how the color has changed. Now, I think that it's a little bit too loud and I don't want it. Um, so I'm going to change it, but just make sure that you have a colon here in case you want to add more elements later for this section and then close the bracket. All right. So now I'm just going to change it up with the other beige hex code and yes now it has blended both of these sections together um, and if I take it out completely it switches back to the original that's it that's how you would change the background color of a section in your index collection of pages well I hope that this was helpful. Go ahead and make the tweak on your site and I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.